What's going on guys, Casual Savage here and in this video I'm going to be announcing to you Vegas Pro 15, the release date, the new features and the different versions. Now you guys can already see this on Magix's website, Vegas Pro 15 is announced to the public and there are three different versions as I mentioned. There's Vegas Pro 15 Edit, there's Vegas Pro 15 and there's Vegas Pro 15 Suite. Now there is a bit of a price difference between each of them and I will be getting onto that later on. So with Vegas Pro 15 Edit, you'll be able to get definable visible button sets, which means you will be able to have buttons on screen and you decide what they do. There's going to be hardware acceleration from modern graphics cards and Intel QSV, selectable background shade, logical modern docking window controls, LUT, crop and picture in picture OFX plugins. So LUT Hopefully that is the exact same one that is currently in Premiere Pro. Uh, that is really good for color correcting and hopefully they are bringing it to Vegas. Now remember that is the cheapest version of what's there. The next version of course is just Vegas Pro 15 and this includes everything I've just mentioned but on top of that it includes a DVD architect, new blue effects filters 5 ultimate and hit film movie essentials. So that will be good for those who do create short films or someone who is into filming outside of YouTube. And of course onto the final one which is the most expensive one, Vegas Pro 15 Suite. Now this comes with everything I have already mentioned but additionally to that it comes with Boris FX Sapphire Render Unit and it also comes with New Blue FX Titler Pro 5. Now in many videos I've done in the past I've always mentioned how much I like the Vegas Pro user interface. It's much more easier, it's much more simpler to me compared to the likes of After Effects or Premiere Pro. Well they've actually changed the interface. So take a look at it. So this is the new interface. Now this is how it will look however you can change the different color shades of the background like I have mentioned earlier. There's four different background shades you can pick from. I believe the one on screen you're looking at is the darkest shade available. But other than that, nothing has really changed. Everything is now more square, bigger. For example, the preview window is much more bigger. Usually it's a, a bit more smaller than that, but it does look a lot more better. Now there's also a button menu system called Hamburger, buttons that will organize and customize the interface and besides what I've already mentioned earlier in this video there is a newly designed timeline clip events for more organized timeline work. So here are the new features they have announced in the hardware acceleration. So there's now improved real-time preview performance and render times with improved Nvidia card support and quick sync video support. Additionally to that, there is picture-in-picture -picture and crop OFX plugins with real-time controls on video preview. There is lockup table, which is LUT OFX plugin. There is now an instant freeze frame and selective paste event attribute. So as I mentioned earlier that I will be telling you the price and the release date and I've also been telling there is a price difference. So Vegas Pro 15 edit, which is the lowest end one, but is still a very good editor, is coming at $399.99. We have Vegas Pro 15, which comes at $599. And finally, we have Vegas Pro 15 Suite, which comes at a staggering $799. Now, all of this is available to you on August 28th this year. They've left it quite late to announce it, but August 28th this year, they will be releasing Vegas Pro 15. Hopefully Magix will hook me up and uh, allow me to do a giveaway for you guys. Um, yeah, let's hope they do. And if they do, I will be announcing it as soon as I can. Now, I guess the main feature I'm looking forward to is the LUT effects and of course the new layout. It does look pretty good in the darker shades but we'll see how well the overall editing experience is. But that's it for this video. Hopefully you guys have enjoyed it. I will keep you updated if there are any more updates on Vegas Pro 15. But thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe, rate, and peace. Fun facts before I go. Last year I made this video for Vegas Pro 14. YouTube took down my video for four months for no reason. Don't do it again.